series I'm going to be doing. I want to just tell you a bit about eyes. So the first part now is going to be about pupils constricting and dilating. This little thing here, I saw it in the shop. I was there with my ex fiance and his son. So of course Ben and I ran towards these things and the little hearts they had as well. And my nickname being I, I just had to have this. You saw my eyes this afternoon. I was sitting in the sun. So what happens is people think the pupils dilate, they don't. What happens is the iris acts like a lens, like a camera, or a camera like I would like to like prefer to say the camera acts like an eye, because that's how it actually is, is it not? So what happens is the iris, you all know, when you're exposed to a lot of light, the iris actually is the thing that moves, not the pupil. What it does is it closes, okay? And you get pinprick pupils. Let's just see. By the way, I'm doing it like this because I'm so sick of seeing my bloody mug every time I make videos. I'm really sick of it. Every time I try and choose a different frame, it only shows my face. Okay, so uh, this made this slightly more interesting because I'm sick of seeing my mug. What I want to tell you guys is, that's quite sexy. Yeah, that's sexy. Okay, now why? Let's, okay, let's talk about cats. Cats have brilliant night vision, hence their eyes. You always see a lot of iris during the day. They don't need to take in much light. At night, their eyes go black, like mine. I was, I actually eventually got tired of being asked if I was on cocaine. The stimulant, stimulant stimulates the nervous system, and any type of excitement makes your pupil larger. Okay. Now, what I want to say, I'm going to try and keep it brief. I've got a problem with rambling. So basically, kept brief. What Italian women used to do, I forget which century, is they used to put belladonna tincture into their eyes to make the pupils dilate. Because if one is sexually attracted to somebody, that is when your pupils actually dilate the most. Also, fear will make your pupils dilate. That's why when you see little cartoon drawings, uh, somebody's got a fright, you see them very wide-eyed. But they have tiny little pupils, so it looks scary. Whereas it's actually you who's reading it as scared. But it shouldn't be that way. They should actually have huge pupils and huge, their eyes should open wide, which which what they do do, but they do them with little pinprick pupils, which is scary. They don't pull you in. When your pupils dilate, these black orbs, they're like black holes, literally, because black absorbs light. That's why a black hole, light cannot escape it. But with the eye, we all know it's, it's got a retina, and it's reflected again. I'm going to get back to the story about the woman in Italy, Belladonna Tincture. They used to put it into their eyes, and what that would do was make their pupils dilate. So that men were attracted to them. And it really works. So, you guys, if you're looking at somebody and you're sexually attracted to them or they're attracted to you, the pupils dilate immensely, the nostrils flare, 
and you don't realize it. You're reading it on a subconscious level. So the clever trick of these Italian women was to do that. Um, regarding me, as I said, my eyes go pitch black at night, and I got sick and tired of being told I was on cocaine, with that being a stimulant, or stimulants in large pupils. So I went to the optometrist and he just said, I'm obviously nocturnal and have very good night vision. I said, yes, quite correct. That's what it is. He said, it's genetic. Then I looked at my grand's eyes. She had it. I looked at my niece's eyes. She's got, she's got the most gorgeous, gorgeous turquoise eyes. Her pupils are huge by day and night. So you just sometimes made that way. On a dark night, I can see it really well without light. But I suffer from road blindness because my pupils are so big that they can't handle it if a car's headlamps shine into them. Okay. So I just thought that's the first little bit about eyes. I'm going to be doing a lot about eyes. Eyes fascinate me totally. Just thought I'd bring that in as a first. I find the sexual one very interesting. So, yeah, I'm not complaining that my pupils dilate at night. Um, I'm, if people will read it, I'm giving out a, a signal of sexual attraction and it draws people in. Pinprick pupils repel. Trust me. Next time you look into somebody with nice big black pupils, it's, it's warm. Unless they're on tripping on acid. I remember in here, the guy, the really innocent guy from the country, they gave him some um, LSD and his eyes, eyes turned into black eyeballs. That's not too wonderful to look at. <laughs> okay, I'm going to end there. So next time you want to look sexy, I don't know how, just try and get your pupils to dilate. Don't, don't do it with substances, for God's sake. Try and, try and use lighting. Turn the lighting down. Okay, that's why people turn lighting down. Clever, huh?